Hey everyone! So this video is mostly an overview on the Too Faced Melted Lipsticks. I have reviewed these lipsticks twice now, both when the original shades came out and the additional shades came out. So if any of this sounds familiar, it's because it is. As an overview, I'm just going to be going over the shades in total, their descriptions, and show you swatches, as well as newly introducing lip swatches. So I hope that you can find this helpful in selecting which shades you might possibly want to pick up. In a whole, Too Faced really nailed their performance and their overall quality. Regardless of shade, these lipsticks are consistent in being pigmented, smooth, opaque, longer lasting, and very comfortable to wear. So if you're interested in seeing an overview of all of the Too Faced melted lipsticks that I own, as well as swatches and lip swatches, etc., then just keep on watching. The Too Faced Melted Liquefied Longwear Lipstick is an intensely saturated lip color with a precision tip applicator. They are 0.4 ounces each and they retail for $21 US, $25 in Canada and are available in 10 shades. It is said to have the shine of a gloss, lasting power of a stain, and a pigment packed color of a liquid lipstick all in one high impact formula. I own 8 of the 10 shades available which are Melted Violet which is described as a violet orchid, Melted Fig is described as a rosy orchid, Melted Peony is described as a dusty rose. Melted Marshmallow is described as a candy pink. Melted Fuchsia is described as a hot pink. Melted Candy is described as a bright fuchsia pink. Melted Ruby is described as a blood red. And Melted Berry is described as a berry red. This is when we move on to the review part. If you have seen the previous reviews, feel free to not really pay attention because I'm just gonna say the same thing that I have said in the last two videos because these lipsticks are consistent in quality. The packaging is a simple colored tube with a screw-on cap. The color of the tube indicates what color the lipstick is and they're pretty much an identical spot-on match which is incredibly helpful. They feature a velvety angled applicator which disperses the product through tiny holes when you squeeze the tube. The formula is fantastic and the consistency of the product is exactly as described, a melted lipstick. It's not too thick, but it's also not runny or thin like some lip stains can be. The shades were all consistent in being very pigmented, smooth, opaque, applying evenly, and a little product goes a very long way. You almost have to think in the sense of an OCC lip tar, you need just a small amount of product to cover your entire mouth. The brand does offer more vibrant, bold shades, but they're all surprisingly a lot more wearable than you would expect. Because of the built-in applicator, application is very, very easy and the color doesn't settle into the fine lines of my lips or feather throughout the day. On initial application, they have a slightly glossy satin finish which turns to a satin matte during wear. Although they never do completely set or turn into a matte, so they will transfer. The lipsticks were comfortable to wear, like a lipstick, and were neither drying or hydrating to my lips like some lip stains can be. All eight shades wore well for six hours before showing any noticeable fading, and depending on the shade, it did leave behind a stain. Melted Violet is a vibrant purple magenta with cool undertones. Melted Fig is a muted purple pink with neutral undertones. Melted Peony is a muted medium pink with neutral undertones. Melted Marshmallow is a brightened light pink with yellow undertones. Melted Fuchsia is a vibrant fuchsia pink with cool undertones. Melted Candy is a bright medium pink with cool undertones. Melted Ruby is a vibrant medium red with cool undertones. And Melted Berry is a bright deep berry red with cool undertones. It's also the shade I am currently wearing. So as you can probably tell, a lot of the shades have cooler undertones to them, but like I said, the performance and quality is consistent throughout the bunch. They're pigmented, they glide on easily, they're comfortable to wear, and on initial application they all have that kind of glossy satin finish which turns into a satin matte throughout wear. They're by far one of my favorite lipsticks and lipstick formula. Overall, they're a fantastic product and I highly recommend giving them a shot if you haven't already. The Too Faced Melted Liquefied Longwear Lipsticks really are a happy medium between a lipstick and a lip stain. So if lip products are appealing to you, you, I highly, highly recommend checking them out. So let me know in the comments below if you've tried any of the melted lipsticks and what your favorite shades are. As always, don't forget to check out my blog for more details, photos, and swatches, and lip swatches. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to show your support. As I always say, I hope you found this overview slash review helpful, and I hope that you have a fantastic day, and thank you so much for watching.